guys, welcome back to the channel. Happy Tuesday. Today we're doing another Test It Out Tuesday. If you're new to the channel, I do have a full playlist of these Test It Out Tuesday videos. Basically, I'm going to be putting a new product to the test that I have not tried yet. So pretty much like a first impression. I'm going to give you guys my thoughts, my opinions on the product. Did it work? Did it not work? So for today's Test It Out Tuesday, I'll be testing out the Elf Cosmetics Marshmallow Soothing Mask. This really intrigued me uh, when I read the information. I've heard some really good reviews. I seen Kathleen Lights use this product, so I'm really curious to try it out. I did order this during the huge Black Friday sale. So this mask retails for $10 and you get 1.76 ounces, which is 50 grams of product, so a decent amount. So it says that this soothing clay mask calms the skin with a nourishing layer of our rich opaque clay gel hybrid formula. Infused with coconut water, kale and clay, and shea butter, this mask leaves your skin feeling supple, soft, and soothed. It also says that all e.l.f. skincare products are free from parabens, sulfates, and phthalates. Of course, this is cruelty-free and vegan and also budget-friendly. Definitely when it comes to like skincare, my skin can just freak out. And recently my skin freaked out from some new products I've been trying out. And yeah, so I've got some spots going on here. Maybe this mask will help. We'll have to see. So let's go ahead and put this on. I'm super excited. Love the packaging. This is like really, really nice. Doesn't really have much of a scent. So I like that. It's not super heavily fragranced. So it says to apply an even layer to clean, dry skin, avoiding the eye and lip area. Leave on for 10 to 15 minutes, then rinse well with warm, water oh oh that's cold <laughs> that is so cold wow this is super white stark white oh it's really thick i can already tell you it's super super thick feels really good so far i'm just picking up a little bit at a time not a lot because i want to make sure that this will last you know more than just a few uses <laughs> I think that's pretty good definitely I noticed if you try to go over a spot like back over a spot it's like lifting so it's definitely starting to set so I would definitely suggest applying this as quickly as you can in an even layer but applied really nicely it is so <laughs> looking at myself in the viewfinder so far it feels really good um, I have applied masks in the past where as soon as I start applying them especially uh, clay masks where it starts burning so no burning so far all right so I just set my phone to 12 minutes so I'm gonna let this sit on my skin and I will pop back on here once it's completely dry just to kind of do a little check-in with you guys and then eventually I'll have to go to my bathroom and wash it off and I won't be able to take you with me so <laughs> I will see you guys in just a moment all right guys I am back it has been 12 whole minutes so here's what the mask looks like I know that this is so white, it's probably blinding the camera. So here's what it looks like. It's definitely completely dry. Actually, it dried pretty fast. I would say after like probably five or six minutes. Um, it doesn't feel super drying. It actually feels really good. My skin feels good. I have a really wet, warm washcloth. Typically, I will do this with a mask like this just so it's not too messy. get stuff in my nose. <laughs> Does anyone else get stuff in their nose? And sometimes I have to take a q-tip and get it out. <laughs> All right guys, so I splashed my face with some warm water off camera, pat dry with a soft towel. I have to say, my final thoughts, my skin feels so soft and smooth and plump. It doesn't feel overly dry, but this is like, wow. <laughs> like my skin feels so, so soft. I have to say, I give it a thumbs up. I really like this mask. 
I would say all skin types can use this mask, but if you have more dry sensitive skin like I do and you can't use clay masks but you still want to try something like this, I would definitely recommend this. So my skin right now feels incredible. That is everything you guys. That was my Test It Out Tuesday on the e.l.f. Cosmetics Marshmallow Soothing Mask. I give it a thumbs up. Really great first impression. I already know this is going to be my new favorite mask. It's just nice to treat your skin to something at the end of the week or end of, the, of a really busy work day. Whatever is going on in your life, pamper yourself. I love that this is super affordable, cruelty free, vegan, easy to apply, doesn't irritate the skin. I'm in love. <laughs> I'm really in love. I'll put a direct link down below in the description box if you guys want to check this out and purchase it for yourself. So that is everything you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on new videos every single week on Tuesdays, Fridays, and sometimes on Sunday. 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will see you all in the next video. Remember, smarter beauty is better beauty. Bye, guys.